Hey guys, now um, you kind of need to uh, prepare yourselves and batten down the hatches because um, I think things are going to move pretty quickly. Oh, I'm getting carried away with this build. I'm absolutely loving it. Um, now, I, I wanted to show you this because I wanted to show you this skybridge. Now, I love this skybridge layout. Like, the more time I've spent with it, the more I love it. But some, some of the guys were having a bit of a chat in the comments and... Um, uh, uh, they've kind of made me think about something else and I played around with it and I like it so you know what I'm taking these out and I'll, oh this is a I'm torn guys oh, I do like those right um, oh while I'm, while I'm, I've been playing around and I wanted to show you this at night time while the roads are lit up um, I've been playing around and I, I changed the alignment of these buildings right so let's take a look at this one because this one's the, the best kind of example and um, I think they look really really good when they're aligned this way really really like that and um, what I've done I've done two of them but I've left one and yeah oh you know what let, let me show you this because it's really quick to do so um, what we do go in here take this one out this one over here right good then now I'm doing this without guides, so I'm doing this freehand. Um, because actually the guides create like a slightly too big uh, area uh, to place the building in. So um, you, you, you're better off doing this freehand. Right, we go back to the roads and uh, just take a high density normal road because we're within the normal borders. Now, okay, let me zoom right in so you can see this. Like This is just for anybody who's doing it themselves. Okay, you see these little um, pedestrian paths? by the side of this uh, mega tower you want the road kind of like just on the edge of those right that is pretty much bang on right let me zoom out a little bit hold down the shift key so it's straight then we do the same on the other side so about there and you can kind of play around with this to get it like pixel perfect if you want to but I think actually I've got it Oh, it's going to be close because it's, it, it is really tight um, to get them absolutely bang on. Right, let's take this building and are you going to fit? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Got it first time. Actually, I could, I, you know, I could get that like a tiny, tiny bit closer. Which side needs to move? Uh, that's this this side needs to come in just a fraction <laughs> sorry guys the OCD kicking in but man and I've got so much to show you oh, I've, I've been playing around with it. I'm getting really carried away with this it's really starting to go I'll wait till I show you what I'm gonna do with the center oh you're gonna love it okay I think that's like a, a pixel or two closer let's go back over here and pick up the building. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I think I got it. Yeah. Right, we want it that way aligned. Boom. Right. And then all I do, just to create kind of a little bit of interest, is just take out this, um, whoops, take out this little bit at the front. There we go. And, whoops, and then if we come down here and I turn this on, oh, and it lights up, the academy sign, and then the building lights up. Oh, way better. Loving it. Okay, right, let's get on with these, um, these sky bridges and the whole center thing. Right, I've put, a, um, uh, I've put a sky bridge on the top of this base, this mega tower base. All right, you want to see it? Okay, let's do it. So let's go to Mega Towers. The, okay, the, like the idea behind this was um, and I've got to remember how the hell I wanted to hook this up. I wanted to put that one to this one. And when you first see this, guys, you'll probably be a bit, I eh, don't know about this, but trust me, trust me, it's going to grow on you guys. And this one up to here and this one up to here 
Okay, now, so like top down, you get kind of this windmilly kind of effect, right? like blades of a propeller. But when you start looking at this from down here, and you start, and I've been looking, I seriously, I've been doing little slow camera spins for like half an hour. Let's get rid of these symbols so we can see this properly. It, seriously, guys, this is going to grow on you. Uh, I'd say I like this one as much as I liked the old one, and I loved the old one. Uh, so, but, right, now, uh, and and this is like the, 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 the crux of the, the, the conversation that was going on. This center part, right, you've got um, the Mega Tower base with three entrances, okay? We don't actually need these tunnels connecting to these because all of the vehicles will use these sky bridges. The, the problem I had with when I was kind of looking at this is this is too, like these tunnels, it's like too connected, right? We, we haven't got this kind of separation that I wanted. So what we're going to do, we're going to take out these tunnels. We don't need them. Boom, boom, boom. And finally, this one, which I like because it, it tidies up the insides of these as well, which is kind of cool. Right. That gives us more separation from, um, f from each of the factions, which I like. Then we're also going to get rid of um, these connections because I'm going to redo them. Um, eh, am I going to redo that one? I'll probably, actually, I probably won't redo that one, but I'm going to redo these ones. Because, oh, we've got to be careful. I don't delete the wrong things. Because we're getting rid of this uh, outside road. Yeah, it's what it is. Right, and um, we're going to get rid of these outside roads. Boom, boom, boom. And then we're going to hook those tunnels up. And like I'm I'm still trying to decide am I going to use avenues for this and I think I am because it'll just look tidier from the entrance and I'll show you I'll kind of show you why so we hook that one up to there one two three four five six we get a nice tunnel same on this one and I know some people will be out there going yes yes that's what we wanted oh come on don't be silly yep there we go Now, this, I, I wonder if I can trim this road back a little bit more. I may be able to. Um, but let's just hook this up, first of all. Oh, will you do something sensible, please? Okay, let, let's just trim this back a little bit and then see if we can get a, a sensible connection. There we go. That's better. Now, can I trim this back without demolishing? Yes, I can. Whoa, Excellent coolness. Right now, you'll see that this is just like a whole lot tidier because we've just got those three connections. Now, what this means is that this is now like a security checkpoint, which is what people were talking about. They were saying, why not use the Mega Tower as a security checkpoint? So, all the traffic has to come in through this single Mega Tower and then it goes out through the Sky Bridges to the factions and I've got to say oh hell yeah I love it absolutely love it that is so much tidier let's actually like put it on slow but like so it's like alive and it's just awesome let's put the garbage on see if the garbage trucks will actually do something let's, I guess we'll have to speed it up again now oh yeah look garbage trucks and they're going up and they're using the sky bridges they're going and collecting the garbage. How cool is that? And I'm pretty sure that that's going to kind of like solve our traffic issue. Which wasn't really an issue, despite what people were saying. But there you go. Oh, look at how oh, Seriously, how cool is that? Right, all right. Lots more to do. Let's bang that on pause for a second. Now, I kind of wish I'd shown you this at night because this, um, this shows up a lot better at night. But you'll still see what I'm on about I was looking at these um, these buildings we put these six in right and I guess I should have put the others in but 
to, to see what they look like. But my favourite, like by far, this one. Like dramatically, you know, and I'm going to just put this on so you can kind of see. It's got uh, it's got the whole colour scheme, really nice. It's got the bits of green neon. It's got the smoke coming out. It's got lots of things moving. And it's just generally very white and bright and neon green and stuff. i kind of not a fan of these ones with these. Uh, yeah, kind of, yeah. These ones, like, would be kind of good over by the eco area, maybe. But, um, yes, yeah, so, you know what? Uh, you know, again, going with the uniformity thing, we're going to go with these. So it's, um, that's one, two, it's number three. So let's just pause this for a second. We'll get rid of these other ones. Um, so that one, that one, that one, that one, that one. And we will go with uh, high density, high tech. Oh, no, medium density, uh, high tech. And we want building number three. There we go. Now, are you going to mess around? Are you going to... Yeah, there we go. And boom and... Oh, come on. Come on. Don't mess around. Don't mess me around. There and... There and... There. Cool. Right, so that's those done. Now, what I'm thinking of doing is in front of these maybe putting in just like some low density around here because I want to keep this like you know I, and I've got to say Joan I, I was kind of critical of, of Joan when she was saying that she wanted like from high all the way to low and the more I've been looking at this like I've been looking at this eco one and I'm thinking you know what I think she might be right actually because um I think maybe going from high to low around here might be better. And actually, with the eco one, I'm seriously tempted to to maybe even get rid of these buildings and just have these to to really emphasise that green colour scheme even more. Um, and maybe do something else with these. Maybe, may, like maybe even put it like some of those like round the outside or something. We will see about that. But right, let's get back to um, banging in some some low density and see what we've got so let's take a look low density uh, high well dope, dope, residential see I'm getting carried away guys um, now these ones and I probably need to do a similar thing for these with that I did with the uh, all the other bit oh come on come on go jump to a snap point mm, now like how do I want to lay these out do I want just these going round here, oh, and I might put like a, another road in, maybe not quite as far out. Ooh, maybe I'll kind of like another bubble and put a couple of rows of these in. What do you think? Um, but we kind of need to find like a, like a good building or buildings that we can use. So, yeah, I, I'm, <laughs> I'm kind of tempted by that idea now. Let me put my guides back on we'll bang a road in and uh and we'll see what we think because like you, you, all you can do is try these things so where's my guides there's my guides so let's take a uh, high density and this is the nice thing that you can be consistent with your roads you, your your density of roads is no longer tied to the density of the buildings which is freaking sweet so i'm thinking that we bring a road out like kind of kind of sort of like this so that it's at 90 degrees there we go then bring it round to here probably probably do two runs there there and whoops lost my lost my point oh come on stop playing around oh it's at the blooming edge ah that's right at the edge I have to go back in just like one and come on come on yes thank you I want to be kind of like right up to there cool alrighty and again I'll probably look at the different buildings uh, and figure out like which one's suitable for uh, for which but like for now let's just bang some of these in and just kind of see like how they look and what we get and 
and we'll see. So now I hope the um, the construction vehicles are going to be able to get there using the sky bridges. They certainly should, and there they go. And they're starting to build, so that's peachy. Now, come on. We want some good looking one. Oh, ho, ho. Alrighty. Yeah, now, I think. I see this one and this one are the really, really good looking ones. And then, kind of, this one here is is kind of okay I'm, I'm kind of looking for an eco one like is there a nice eco one but hmm no you know what though there is another and there are another four of these you know what let's let's pop the other four in and see what the other four look like oh oh we can squeeze one in there and there sweet Aha! Now, there's... That one is um, is very green looking with the, with the green roof and whatever. And it's still nice and modern. But to be honest, I get, that's, like, that's kind of square and angular and, and also kind of grey. And I'm thinking that might actually be kind of good for here. Uh, what about the other ones? This one over here is, uh, is an option. Although, yeah, I don't know where it you. That kind of looks almost like a little office building. Oh, man. I'm going to have such fun putting these in. And let's take a look and see how exactly that kind of looks. Like from a an above perspective. And, oh, yeah. I need to be careful that these don't get kind of too close together. I want the separation. So, hmm. You know, I might even do this kind of like on on one side only, or I don't know. I don't know. Oh, okay. A couple of other things that I want to do, like while we're kind of messing around with the buildings and... Um, it's this this whole like like tall to tall to short thing, and I'm seriously thinking about either putting two more of these uh, military buildings in and replacing these two admin buildings, or just swapping these around so we've got the two military buildings here and then it goes down to the to the admin buildings. And meh, you know what? I'll put a couple of military buildings in first. Right, and we'll see how that looks, and then I might switch it around. So um, it's building. These are building two. So we want number fourteen. So high density, high wealth. Uh, fourteen, boom. So let's put you in there and there. And the other thing that I'm thinking of doing is actually bunching these together and see if I can get a fifth building in. You know what? I'm actually going to do that. I'm going to do it. Uh, like, am I going to take those little parklets out? I was really looking forward to playing with those parklets, but I think this might just look better with an extra building in. But, you know, we'll see. And the, the, the only way you can figure this out is do it. So let's go to, so we want two of these, so one, two, and then we want building two is the pointy one, there, there, will you fit, oh man, no it won't, hmm, ooh, we may have to move the parks, because, because I kind of really want to try this. Let's uh, move this park and uh, we'll see if we can make this happen. So, if it's not there, it's a, hmm, actually, I don't mind that. Let's see if that will fit a, another building now. Oh, this is, we're really into the tinker, oh, look, boom, yes, it fits. 
Okay, you know what? Let's let that build, right? And we'll see exactly what that looks like. Oh righty, so we've got them built. Oh, uh, I well, I don't know what you think, guys, but I think it's a no-brainer that um, it. I think it looks better with the five buildings than it does with the four, personally. Uh, you know, I'm sure some people would will disagree, but because it's aesthetics, everybody likes something slightly different. Yeah, 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 and I like the fact that we've got the, the, the two tall ones and then the three shorter ones. It looks better. It looks better. Right. Okay, I'm going to do a bit of um, tinkering around with the buildings then, and um, and I'll start messing around with the um, the low density.